NASDAQ Incorporated's Chief Executive Officer, Adina Friedman, will take on the additional role of board chair, according to the company on Monday, executing a playbook similar to that at other peers, but ultimately frowned upon by corporate governance advocates. The proposed change comes as the exchange operator is pushing for more board diversity. Last year, NASDAQ proposed requiring companies listed on its exchange to publicly disclose the diversity credentials of their boards. By 2026, companies would also be required to have one director who self-identifies as female and another as an underrepresented minority or LGBTQ+, or explain why they do not have such representation. Right now, Calkine is offering a 7-day free trial on its premium research reports. Get access to data-driven market insights combined with an in-depth analysis on financial markets across the globe. Don't miss it. Subscribe for the free trial now. Corporate governance experts contend that separating the chairman and CEO roles improves accountability and provides checks and balances in the boardroom. But others argue that splitting the jobs can cause confusion over who is in charge. Friedman will take over the new role on the 1st of January. During her five years as CEO, the company has expanded beyond its traditional exchange business into software and anti-financial crime technology. Intercontinental Exchange Incorporated, CME Group and CBOE Global Markets Incorporated also have CEOs holding chairperson titles. But what are your thoughts on Friedman's joint roles? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like and share the video. For more content, you can subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. I'm James Preston, reporting for Calkine Media.